Lord, I trust God. I trust the living God's going to bring to me what matches my frequency. And sometimes it's going to be a little bit uncomfortable. And then I keep working on raising my frequency and drawing new. I don't pretend to you. I don't know what I know so that you can have it be a little quiet and calm so that you can digest it. Your delicate senses can listen to me. I will not do that. The energy that is coming through me is coded by that power of the living God. I bring that energy up for you, brothers and sisters, and I bring that energy up for me to create the reality that I might prefer. I am here on this video tonight to empower myself, to embolden myself. Oh, I lie in the corner in the fetal position, waiting for the living God to pick me up and put me into contentment when I refuse to believe in the power of the living God. And I refuse to acknowledge that my thoughts are part of the living God. And I can lay there and I can hate myself and be not worthy of nothing. Now I praise God for having just lay there. Then I am not focused on the power of the living God. And I cannot call upon the power of the living God. When I am focused on all of my thoughts on my own misery and what I think is her misery and her misery and his misery. He should be doing this and he should be doing that. And she's not awake enough and he's not awake enough. And don't they know and they should know. Well, I know. What am I doing about it? I'm awake and I know stuff. What I choose to do with it is just sit here and go, wait, wait, I know stuff. They don't know stuff. Ha, ha, they don't know stuff. You need to know stuff. Hey, you need to know stuff. Well, you know stuff. What are you doing with it? I'm telling you, you need to know stuff. That's what I'm doing with my stuff. No. Take your stuff that you've learned. And focus your mind and your heart on what you want to create with the power, the power, the power. What you think about right now? What you think about right now? That's creating your tomorrow. What you're thinking right now is going out into the power of the living God. Is the power of the living God being used to create life for you that's more content, more at peace, more beautiful, more good health and fun? Or is your thought? 